Alright, good evening, Broken Chains. I'm back. Hey, um, I seem to have lost my band. And it's, it's amazing how these things happen. You lose one drummer and it just becomes contagious. Isn't that crazy? Fortunately, I haven't played long enough and sing long enough that I'm always quick to look for other people to join me. And you know what? I see a lot of faces out there that I just know would love to join me and make some sound, make some noise, lift their voices. So if you would be willing to help me tonight, why don't you come on down here, come a little closer, stand on your feet. Let's worship God together and just welcome him into this place. We've already experienced the joy of baptism, life being changed. God pursues us. We're going to sing a song that talks about God inviting us into His presence. Father God, tonight we thank You that You are a God that invites us in. And You say, the way between God and us has been removed. There's, the curtain has been torn. Hello? There you go. The curtain has been torn and because of the shed blood of Jesus Christ, we can enter into the very presence of the God Most High. So we enter into the Holy of Holies tonight, worshiping you, God. And we stand face to face with the creator of all the universe, knowing that, God, you love us tonight. We lift these songs to you, and we just praise you in all that we do. So help us make a joyful noise tonight. We pray this in Jesus' name. Purified and righteous 
would enter in to make offering for the people. They'd tie a rope to his legs in case he wasn't pure and he'd be struck dead. They could pull him out. People worship God on the other side of the curtain. But when Jesus Christ hung on a cross for you and for me, and he gave up his spirit, he said, it is finished. The Gospels tell us there was an earthquake and the temple foundation moved and that curtain was literally torn in two. And God let the whole world know that by the shed blood of Jesus Christ, we were no longer separated from a God who called us by name, who loves us. And we can enter right into his presence, past the outer courts, past the place of worship, and into the very presence of God. And tonight he's saying to you, no matter where you've been, no matter what you've gone through, no matter what you've carried in here today, I ask you, just lay it down. God says, come into my presence. Come and worship me face to face. Because i got something for you. I have blessings for you. I have joy for you. I've got righteousness for you that can only be found in the presence of God. Take me past the outer courts to the holy place, past the brazen altar. 